We've been looking at Romans chapter 1, verse 16, where the scripture says, Paul says, as he speaks to the intellectual elite in Rome, and he says this with great confidence, I am not ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ, for it's the power of God and the salvation to everyone who believes, to the Jew first and then to the Gentile. So we're focusing on good news, and the good news is about Jesus Christ, and we are trying to make this assertion that Jesus can meet every basic need of your life. And so today we want to talk about how Jesus meets our need for satisfaction. In the fourth uh, book of uh, C.S. Lewis's book, the, the Silver Chair, in that series called The Tales of Narnia, there's a little girl named Jill, and she enters this imaginary kingdom of Narnia. And there she meets Aslan, who is the lion, who is the symbolic figure of Jesus Christ, and they're, they're talking around uh, and situated around a stream of water, of cool water. And Jill's very thirsty, and so she cries out for a drink, and the lion asks her if she is thirsty. And here's how it goes. I'm dying of thirst, says Jill. Then drink, said the lion. Oh, may I? Could I? Would you mind going away while I do, said Jill? The lion answered this only by a look and a very low growl. And as Jill gazed at its motionless bulk, she realized that she might as well have asked the whole mountain to move aside for her convenience. The delicious rippling noise of the stream was driving her frantic. Will you promise not to do, to, do, to do anything to me if I come, said Jill? I make no promise, said the lion. Jill was so thirsty now that without noticing it, she had come a step closer. Do you eat girls, she said. I have swallowed up girls and boys and women and men, kings and emperors, cities and realms, said the lion. It didn't say this as if it were boasting, not as if it were sorry, nor as if it were angry. It just said it. I daren't come and drink, said Jill. Then you will die of thirst, said the lion. Oh, dear, said Jill, coming another step nearer. I suppose I must go and look for another stream then. There is no other stream, said the lion. Only Jesus Christ can meet your deepest needs. Jesus is the only one that can truly satisfy you. You think about that and get close to him.